Yo no vatos, thanks again for tuning in to yet another video of is coming at you live yet again from the West Coast out here in California. We're going to be doing another unboxing. This is my second attempt at finding a, a decent monoshock. I had some, some type of, a, of an improvement or decent um, suspension for my Lowrider S. So this is, as you can see in the box, it says Fox. Uh, ride fox ridefox.com this is of course a 13 inch so this should be a little bit shorter than my first attempt if you guys remember seeing that progressive 13.1 this is 13 inches so it should be slightly um, i'm guessing it should be at 13 inches instead of 13 and a quarter but let's go ahead and start opening this up so you guys can see what's inside the box in case you guys are out there wondering which one should you get or which one are you looking at getting it just depends on on, on on your preference and what you're looking for if you're someone a little bit shorter kind of like myself seven seven feet uh i'm um, seven feet uh, five foot seven then you and you know stuff like that it's just i mean if you like flat footing the bike if you feel comfortable if you guys see my first video there's been a few times where i've lost footing i've yeah i mean just stuff like that if you're out, just out there and you're wondering 13.5 13 inches i'm sure it will make a difference because you have that that half an inch more of a of a travel in your suspension sorry uh it, I, I believe it it would improve it if you if you did go 13.5 instead of 13 inches but you know what it's just a preference thing i want to be a little bit uh, lower than 13.5 even if it is just half an inch it, it does make a difference because like i said my seat raises up my, my seat height by a little bit so we're going to be opening this up let's see what we have in here some of you guys have been mentioning in the comments where and when you order Fox, uh, they actually don't ship you a tool or something like that, or your, or your, um, your tool to uh, to adjust the, the the shock itself. But let's see what happens here. And as far as the progressive shock, of course, I sent that back. I don't know if Revzilla knows who I am or anything like that, or if they've known or anything like that. But they sent me this box in a huge, <laughs> in a huge box. So, I, I mean, I was just surprised when I saw the box. It was huge. It was probably like four by three or something like that. I'll show you guys an image of what this came in, which is, you know, it's a little bit overkill. But you know, if you guys order stuff on Amazon, they always send you like these small little items in these huge big boxes. So let's go ahead. This is the first time opening it up. And holy crap. Wow, look at that. That is a difference of night and day between progressive and and fox wow this is absolutely gorgeous this is beautiful look at this yes that is 10 times better than what you get with progressive i mean i i don't know may, maybe they sent me the wrong box but uh like i said norcal just got this uh, installed on his bike too you guys know about norcal he's he's also a, a, a motor vlogger he he also makes videos on on um on on hvac so if you guys are out there you guys seen his his channel he just got like i said a 13.5 so uh yeah you're you're greeted with instructions let's see what's in the box yeah there's these are great instructions i saw this on norcal's video and the instructions versus what you get with the progressive is yeah it's just like I said, it's just a difference of night and day. I mean, this is way better than what I got with uh, Progressive. You have a lot of details here, a lot of uh, instructions, a whole lot of... Yeah, I mean, this this is high quality. Uh, as you can see... <clears throat> sorry, as you can see, full resolution images. This is just beautiful. And it tells you preloads, adjusting. There is a lot of information here for you to kind of intake so if you're out there and you're i mean if you're not uh known or or if you don't know much about uh, about suspension kind of like myself i don't know a whole lot all i know is you know it, it feels good and 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 you know the, the longer it is the better it is that's what she said <laughs> so I, i'm not gonna pretend like i'm an expert at this i i, I don't know anything about sag or i, I don't know anything about uh the, all the other stuff the you know it's just all that stuff i don't know much about it all right so i'm not going to pretend like i'm some kind of expert so let's go ahead and let's pull this stuff out let's see what else is in here uh i think i have to pull out the shock because this, this is connected so yeah the, as you can see the presentation is is way better than than what you got with the with the progressive this is a, a lot better 
I think I have to remove these. This is this is already ten times better than than uh, than what I got my last time with Revzilla. So, like I said, I don't know if they saw my video or anything like that. You know, let's pull this out. Let's set this to the side. Anything else in the box? No, that's it. The box is is it's a nice box. It's all blacked out. You know, it's just something to kind of point out. It's the uh, it's a detail that that they're taking you know not only is is this high quality uh, shipping or boxing or whatever the material the presentation everything is just you know a top shelf stuff so let's go ahead and pull the shock out man this thing is gorgeous look at this well taken care of nothing like what i got with my progressive shock there's it's not covered in oil i think it's it's, it's actually even sealed i have to open this so like some of you guys mentioned, there is no no tool or anything, but I believe if you have the stock, um, what is that called? It's the fork, the fork tool is like a hook that will work with this, I believe, I think, I don't know. But yes, there isn't a tool or anything like that in the box. Uh, yes, this is absolutely gorgeous. This is a lot, <laughs> this looks a lot better than the progressive shock that I got not too long ago. And you know what? There's a, also a funny little story to that, but I'll be uh, uploading that in, a, I guess, in another video. What happened with that shock and the shipping and UPS? It just, it was just more of a mess. But man, this thing is just beautiful. Look at this. If you guys remember on the Progressive Shock, it was covered in debris. It looked like, like, like I said, it looked like it was, um, it was uh, fiberglass. It was covered up in oil. It was, I mean, it was just grease. It was, it was banged up. It was damaged. I don't know. Like I said, and, and a lot of you guys mentioned in the comments, send it back, send it back, send it back. So I sent it back and uh, I just thought to myself, you know what, should I risk it, install it, and then something, I mean, something be wrong with it. So I just sent it back and now I got this and I'm glad I am, I am glad I ended up getting this. I can feel it all the way down in my plums, getting all swollen. All right, so that's pretty much it. That's the unboxing of the 13-inch Monoshock. It's in pristine condition. As you can see, it, it it's absolutely gorgeous. It's a good-looking shock. Hopefully, it performs as well as it looks. I'm pretty sure it is. So, uh, yes, I mean, I am, I am happy. I am satisfied with this shock so far. Uh, just stay tuned for the install video. I'll probably upload them together. So, anyways, you guys just stay out there. Stay safe. Thanks for tuning in to yet another video. Hit that like button. Guys, stay out there. Stay safe. Don't believe everything you read. Life's a risk. Get out there and write. Later.